the some of the issues that I may have experienced, well, not may have, I definitely did experience is that there's an assumption that I don't know what I'm talking about. Yes. Um, so I also think it's important to remember, um, you know, reaching out and like lifting women up and giving them the opportunity to grow is one conversation, but also being at a point in your life where it's like, this person is literally meeting me where I'm at. We're in the same room. We're sharing the same space. So why don't yeah. I accept the fact that they also have an opinion that is level to mine or might even <laughs> be better than mine? Um, so I think I think just paying attention to that and, and not, um, not just assuming that, you know, I guess it's twofold in this in this part. Um, don't assume that this woman that you're interacting with is there for the wrong reason or whatever. Yeah. Um, they're they've worked hard to mm -hmm. be at, be at the same place or take part in these conversations. So just remember that. Um, but I, I mean, you, you should offer that grace to literally anybody you come across at the same time. So yeah, that's my defense there. Yeah, I guess that's at the core of all of this is really just. Uh, being a really encouraging and supportive person, but also empathizing and understanding where people are coming from, maybe where some of their hesitations are, while also still acknowledging, like Tia said, that they're in the room for a reason. Um, you know, like I said, it's not about babying somebody or, oh, I didn't want to work with this person, but because they're a woman and I, now I really got to reach out. It, it should come from a genuine place of, I really want to collaborate more with you. I want to encourage you, empower you. And it's always, or it should be reciprocated. So it shouldn't just be this one-sided thing where we expect you to pour into all these women and that be it. It's like, it's the same support you want, right? You want somebody to know that your voice is heard. You want somebody to keep you in mind when they have opportunities and you want them to respect you um, like Tia said, and, and acknowledge the hard work that you've put in to get there. And so just really being, um, it's its not so much maybe changing your behavior as more as it is being cognizant of the fact that there are people who don't always have that opportunity on a regular basis. And maybe you can be the person to provide that.